Hello everyone, I am your Kikai Principal. Join me as we talk about life, work, and travel. Please like, share, and subscribe! Dito kami ngayon sa Pearl Farm. White and golden. The golden color here is extremely rare color with her now. The final one is Tahiti. People often call it the black pearl. Black pearl. Because, yeah, because only this one can eat black pearl all over the world. But it, it's never totally black. I mean, black is a name, it's a main color. You can find black with a little bit gray, green, purple, or even like a peacock color, rainbow mm. color. That's make this one special, the black pearl. And these are some. Um, Important landmark of the Nina tree. Before 1893, there were only natural pearl, and in the picture, these are natural pearl. It's not perfect, it's not yeah. round. Mm -hmm. Because they are formed with something like a, a grain of sand or parasite, something in nature stuck inside the oyster body. And the natural pearls are very rare now in the world. So in 1893, a Japanese man named Kokichi Mikimoto, he's like the father of the Nina tree, and he found the technique to cultivate the cultural pearl. And nowadays, Instead of sand, uh, we uh, implant this one into the oyster body. It's the core. We call it the core. It's made of the shell, mother pearl here. We make it round because we want to get it round pearl. And we implant it back into the living oyster. And then it's like, um, you know, defense mechanism. I mean, to protect itself, oyster will stick with nature, cover the core and make it bigger, bigger, bigger to the top. We went for three years in average with 3,000 layers of nacre covering the core. We can have this beautiful pearl, and that's how our pearl is called. And let me show you how we implant, how we have this first step by step career over there. So please, and this is the first step preparation. I'm gonna show you step by step. Uh, we need to be prepared two things before implanting. The first one is the core. I show you before it's made of the shell. And the second thing we need from planting for set is the red one here. Tissue, metal tissue. tissue. It's the muscle of oyster actually. And to get this one, we open oyster like this and you can see the membrane here. Yeah. Attack two mental oyster. We cut it up to get something like this. Remove black paint just to get the middle part. And then we cut it into small pieces. And then we treat it with antibacteria so it's not infected. Okay, that's why you can see it's red now. But the red color, it doesn't affect the color of the pearl in the future. The core and the tissue must be implanted together because core just makes it round. But the tissue here, it plays as a catalyst, kind of catalyst. I mean, it stimulates oyster to secret nacre, cover the core and speed up the process. Mm -hmm. And these are donor oyster, which is even for the membrane, then they die. If you're opening up that, break the structure of the oyster and they die. And we implant it to other oyster, the living oyster in the next step. So it's just for preparation. We're going to implant here in the next table. You can move to the next table. So we open oyster a little bit to keep it alive. And then carefully, she cut a small line in reproductive organ of oyster. And then implant one piece of tissue first, and then one part later, put them inside reproductive organs. It means that the sea water eyes, they just give only one pearl at a time, not like, you know, fresh water muscle. Fresh water muscle can be more, but the quality is much lower compared to this one. And after implanting, keep them here, in the net like this. And then we put them back and see water for them to recover slowly. Then every month we have to come back to check them. We pick them up, yeah, clean the outside. I mean, we check the outside and check the shell while the oyster to breathe and get food from water. And we have to remove the dead oyster or the oyster that we check it from. The susurrating hot lo mein now is about 30 to 40 percent. And the rest 60 to 70 percent, you know, some die, some reject the call. We come back every month to remove them. So 30 to 40 percent. So what? Shorting out, you know, shorting pearl into different set size and color here. Are those real pearls? Yeah. yeah that, that's inside. But... Yeah, mm -hmm. after waiting a few years, we can get the result here. This is Akoya, the first one I show you, and it needs about one to two years to get this sign. Mm -hmm. This is the Tahiti of Black Pearl, and this is the South Sea, uh, with a uh, biggest size and two main color, white and gold in here. How many years to... Three to five years with Tahiti and South Sea. Akoya, one to two years. 
okay. But right. but not all of them are perfect. I mean, we cannot control the quality. Yes. So normally only uh, two to five percent of her habitat are perfect her, mm -hmm. and ninety five percent are imperfect ones. Like these, this is not good enough for jewelry. What she, do you do with that one? We that, that... dry them. We get her powder. It is for cosmetic mm -hmm. products. Mm -hmm. yeah. Into aging cream or moisturizer. Mm. Let the thing you should know the noise, baby. You see how we have this up here? That's a newly harvest. Yes, right. Mmm, fresh. Oh. Wow, so it's a good one. This is the reboot actually. Mm. Where we, where we see the mm. It's coming out. It's on. Um, it's brown. Yeah. And the oyster is already dead after that. They uh, die anyway because they cannot live longer. Akoya just live in maximum three years. But they too, Tahiti and Saucy, they live longer, and we can be implant maximum three times, reuse. Mm -hmm. And uh, this one is quite good her with no eye on. See, it's good or not? Because by the size, the shape and the color of the curve, but to know exactly the quality, we do have a German expert with X-ray machine and, and experience to evaluate the quality. It's an international standard. Uh, the shell here we can use for chauvinier, lack of painting, meat we can eat them now because they die anyway, so we use everything as a part of the Austin value. And let me show you how we evaluate the quality of her in jewelry in our show. Okay. show you the final stick here. So I have here three kinds of pearl I showed you before. Akoya, the South Sea, and the Tahiti of black pearl. All the formation of the pearl you can find here in the back of the top. You know, kind of pearl, size, shape, color, and the, the AA1 is the quality of this pearl. Normally it's great from 1A to 4A. 4A is the best, is the maximum. That is mm -hmm. international standard. Mm -hmm. So 2A1 here is a medium mm -hmm. quality. And all information is you for certificate to guarantee the quality of the pearl. Mm. Every pearl here go with certificate. Mm. It is a necklace. We make the black pearl, but it looks like green. You know, it's not mm -mm. never totally black. Mm -mm. We make with sterling silver. Mm -hmm. In the middle area, we have a go and why go where you can find the 4A pearl, the best pearl. Okay. We label the price here. A lot of zero. How it's much a is number. How much is that? It's 75 US dollar. Mm -hmm. the, or the number in borrow is mm -hmm. dollar. Mm -hmm. So, for and, example, this is 75. And equivalent to how many dong? Uh, Vietnam dong is uh, more than 1 million. Ma 1 million. 1 million 875,000 mm -hmm. Vietnam dong. Okay. But this is a bribe before this car. We are giving you 5% off for everything on showroom now. And uh, final thing I want to show you is the it's made of powder of the imperfect one that we can use for jewelry for anti wrinkle, anti aging. Would you like to test it in your hand? You can drop it into the water. Yeah. Anti aging. Yeah, anti aging. Mm -hmm. It looks like anti aging. You want to try the cream? We need this one badly. We need this one badly. We have the more okay. day cream, night cream, moisturizer. Okay. It is how we organize your room. Serving area, sterling silver. Middle area and the next area, go and why go with the best fur, 4A. Final area, there are some chauvinia jewelry from the shell, mother fur. Thank you very much. For the price depends on the size of the fur. Right? Depends on the quality. And the quality. And the quality depends on five things, just like diamond. Mm -hmm. Luster, color, shape, size, perfection. Not only the color or the, the black one is the cheapest. No, actually, no? if you have a D3 pearl, mm -hmm. it must be in same size mm -hmm. and same quality. So the golden pearl is the most valuable one, and it is quite popular. So it's more interesting. And the black pearl in in the middle, in the middle compared mm -hmm. to. <laughs> Pagkatapos mo gumamit na ang cream na pampabata, biglang bumata na si oh, Sir Henry. <laughs> Sir Bandal, effective ba yung cream? Bumata ka na? <laughs> Gaganda o. Oh. Parang gusto kong bumili. Baby, pabili. <laughs> Joke. <laughs> Ganda. Dami mga part. Ay. Yung isang tao dyan, Siya yung nakabili ng pearl kasi siya yung may pera sa amin. Ako walang nabili. 
Walang pera. <laughs> Ngayon, palabas na po kami. Um, we're done visiting the legend Pearl of Hollow Bay. Bye, bye, bye.